Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is how to start a language learning journal. So I decided to set up this journal as a way of tracking my progress in French. I am currently taking part in the 80 days language learning challenge which I will link below and thought this would be a good way to see how far I've gone, to set my goals and to overall see my progress at the end. So as I mentioned, I've decided to learn French as part of this challenge, but to begin with I will set up the journal in full and then go back and put in my own details so you guys can see what it's like without any French editions. So the first two things I'm setting up is my why box, which is my motivation for learning this language. And then the three smaller boxes are going to be used to track the 80 days over which I'm doing this challenge. Following this is a list of the resources I'm using to learn French. I have divided it into six different boxes to track what I'm using to listen, speak, read and write, as well as my resources for learning vocabulary and grammar. I measured out the boxes before I drew them to make sure I would have enough space for each of my resources, but of course you can change these depending on what you're using yourself. This next page will have a cute sort of sticky note idea to track my three main goals I wish to achieve for this challenge, as well as my ideal daily routine listed out so I can keep track of what I need to do and when. You've probably realised by now that I'm sticking with a blue, red and sort of grey-white pen, which matches the French flag. But of course, again, you can change this depending on the language you wish to learn yourself. My ideal routine runs from 6.30am to 10.30pm. This again is easily changeable depending on your own routines. This next page easily took the longest out of the entire spread to do. It is a list of every Duolingo lesson in French, along with five boxes for me to tick off each level once I have them complete. It took a long time to draw this out guys, but I think it is definitely worth it to keep track of how you're doing. I gave it the steepled effect so it wouldn't be as difficult to read, However, this is something that could easily be done over two pages or even more if you wished. It's just that I was a bit cut for space and had to fit them all on one page. page of this language journal is a daily task checklist. So I divided the page into 80 boxes for each of the 80 days as part of the language channel and below I include the key to track how much I read, write, speak and listen in the language as well as when I learn vocabulary and grammar and on what days. So now I am going back and filling in my own details for learning French. If you want to go ahead and skip this part, it's completely fine as the following details only pertain to my own progress throughout the channel. However, it is interesting to see how this journal is actually used. So I've gone ahead and put in the days for October, November and December, which are the 80 days I wish to cover this challenge in as well as my reasons why I wish to learn French. I've also added the resources I'm using for each category as listed before. Mm -hmm. 
Personally, there are three goals I wish to achieve by the end of this challenge, so there is enough space to write three goals on two lines each. However, if you want to make this one huge paragraph, or if you just want to have one word, that's perfectly okay too. I have also listed my tasks for my daily routine. This is of course personal to me and might be completely different, but this is how I learn best. just inputting what I count as reading, writing, listening, speaking, vocabulary and grammar, and also inputting the names of all 178 French Duolingo lessons. This did take absolutely forever, but I love the final effect. And that is it guys! Now you have your very own language journal based off of the 80 days language learning challenge. I hope you liked this video, please like, subscribe and comment down below if you have any ideas. I post new videos every two weeks and I'll talk to you then.